when they ask her, hey, I'm not that dumb. She was giving me signals all night. Plus, she doesn't mind my house. Poor girl does that because she's not going to give it up. Well, let me let you in on a little secret about girls. There is no point where it's 100% guarantee that you're going to sleep with her. Something can always go wrong that will just kill you. You straight up asking her, didn't we kill the movie? Of right? course it was. That's the most barbaric way of going no, about it. No, let me finish. She <laughs> said she had a boyfriend, a long distance relationship, one of those dudes. Oh, come on. You absolutely could have slept with her if you didn't screw everything up. That's like best case scenario. Best case scenario is her being single. Well, long distance is the best thing. Trust me, those relationships are always on the ground. People are begging for a way out. She wasn't begging for a way out. She said she loved him enough. They all say that. You just gotta mess with their head a little. Make them think that maybe they're getting cheated on. And then they'll be happy to do the same. I've never slept on a different guys. So it was easier than getting a single. It's easier for girls. You can do it too. Of course, it takes some finesse. You can't just go up to a girl and ask, Hey, um, wanna fuck? <laughs> <laughs>
first time, just go up and talk to me. <laughs> Do gorgeous? Hi. What's a pretty girl like you doing all alone here on a Friday night, though? Well, my best friend says I can't keep staying home on the weekends. Staying home? Why would your fine ass be staying home? <laughs> I just got out of a long-term relationship. Huh? <laughs> and I just, I never feel like going out anymore. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I know that game. Uh, hey, how do you fit 200 Jews into a Volkswagen? What? How do you fit 200 Jews into a Volkswagen? I don't know how. Two in the front, two in the back. And 196 in the ashtray! Jesus Christ, Max, what the hell is wrong with you? What, you such a joke! Well, how did you like that? I was trying to light in the mood! Like being at the Holocaust? Well, no, <laughs> but what was that crap about getting out of a relationship? What the hell kind of backstory is that? It's a good backstory, Max. It's believable. The point of this is how believable it is. It's not fun if it's not realistic. Well, you can be realistic without having such a dark backstory. I mean, a breakup? Where's the fun in that? There's tons of fun in that. You can tell me to forget about that guy. That guy's a prick and I deserve better. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, but when we sleep together, I'll feel guilty, you know? Swooping in to bang the poor, heartbroken girl, I'll feel like I'm taking advantage of you. <laughs> Maybe. Okay. I'll come up with a different backstory, but remember how Holocaust was. But they're funny. Not to everyone. What if I've been Jewish? But you aren't Jewish. You don't know that. I'm a stranger, remember? <laughs> okay, okay. No more Holocaust shows. You got it. He's taken. So you can still sleep with her. I mean, at this point, I don't think I even want to. <laughs> <laughs> Why does he keep coming in and leaving? <laughs> I don't know. It just feels like there's something weird going on here. Uh, exactly. <laughs> something weird is going on here. Like a game or something. Now, why would a couple be playing some sort of game? Because, because they're trying to spice things up. Why would a couple be trying to spice things up? Because he's bad at sex! No. no. <laughs> <laughs> the point is, you definitely have a shot here. I'd show her a better time than her boyfriend over there. <laughs> Here's what you do. Hey, honey. <laughs> Ew, Max, don't call me honey. That's creepy. Baby, please tell us. I well, how is that creepy? You just called me babe. Right, but I, I'm calling you babe. Max is my babe, not the shanky. Okay, okay, I, I get it. But for Christ's sake, you got to stop interrupting. You're ruining the whole thing. I mean, I was on board when you said things were getting a little bit stale, and, and I tried all that new stuff you wanted me to do. I bought all that football gear you wanted me to wear. I got the Marshawn Lynch jersey, the Peyton Manning jersey, the, the Randy Moss jersey. I did the thing with the music and the lights and the filming. And I, I was still on board when you said you wanted to try this whole role play thing. But baby, you got to let it go somewhere, OK? OK, but I'm sorry. It's kind of a Bad at sex? I was good enough to get you, wasn't I? I mean, yeah. I don't know how, though. <laughs> <laughs> what? what? What did you say? Nothing, nothing. 
Did you say you don't know how I got you to have sex with me? I'm just saying, if you're with me today, maybe we just wouldn't be together. We wouldn't be together? I mean, it's a different time, you're not so young, and I eat, nothing like I am now. I mean, imagine if this was real life, if that's actually some girl you didn't know. If you were some girl who I didn't know, and I saw you sitting alone at a bar, I'd definitely come up to you. You know, and I'd be interested in you too, baby, but... And if you use any of those lines we use on me tonight, I just don't think we'd end up dating. Of course we would, honey. If if you were some girl who I didn't know, and you tried pushing me away after I first started hitting on you, I wouldn't give up. I'd, I'd try again, I'd say something new, or... I'd just be honest with you and tell you that you're the most beautiful girl I've ever met, and I can't imagine myself being with anyone but you. Okay. Come back and again sweep me off my feet. That's what I like to hear. Just let me work my magic, okay? It'll be fun. You're about to meet the smoothest stranger you know. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see that? They were just fighting. That relationship is very different. Fighting? They just kissed. <laughs> but did you see her before? Did you see her body language? Her posture? Posture. Body language, Christian, it's important. And if you were paying any attention, you would have seen her body language saying, Help me! I need a real man! I don't know. I don't think I can do this tonight. Are you on a period or something? <laughs> Didn't you want to sleep with this girl? Yeah, but... So man the hell up! I can't do this alone, Christian. Help me, help you. <laughs> okay, okay, let's do it. Bonjour. Uh, Hi. What's your name? Anna. Anna, beautiful name. I had a good friend in high school who was also named Anna. She was such a sweetheart. You seem like you're also a really nice person. Well, I like to think so. What's your name? Uh, Philippe. <gasps> Philippe, are you French? Oui, mademoiselle, my mother is from Paris. Oh, Paris. I love Paris. You've been? Yes, once with a bunch of friends. <laughs> well, it's not called the city of love for nothing. Everything is just so romantic. The architecture, the weather, even the language is enchanting. Do you speak French? Oh, we oui, of course. Oh my goodness. Can you say something for me? Francais, petite, fromage, croissant, baguette, french fries, french toast. That's so hot. What about you, Anna? Where are you from? Wait, wait. Let me guess. Ohio? Ohio! Please. Do I look like I'm from the Midwest? I'm from. California. California! I've never been, but I hear it's breathtaking. It's the most amazing landscapes you'll ever see. I should have guessed you are from there. California girls are always the prettiest. Oh, ha ha ha! <laughs> <laughs> you flatter me. A girl like you deserves to be flattered. <laughs> <laughs> oh. uh, I, I, I gotta go drop the kids off at the pool. Oh. Real nice snacks, you were the one who wanted to go to that Tex Mex place for dinner. Just give me a minute. I'll, sorry, Philippe will be right back. Hello? Is anyone in here? Uh, you know this? 
this is the men's bathroom, right? I know, I know. I just, I, I really needed to go to the bathroom, and the girls' bathroom was full of tampons and vomit, and I just couldn't go in there. Wow, that's really gross. <laughs> I was hoping this bathroom would be empty, but... Jeez, this is so embarrassing! Hey, 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 calm down. Um, I, I won't tell anyone, okay? It's not the end of the world. I, I don't even know what you look like. No, it's not that. I just had a really rough night, and getting caught using the guy's bathroom is just the cherry on top. Mm, I don't know about that. <laughs> <laughs> Look, Lynn, 
and just let me guess, all right? There's no harm in that. If I'm wrong, I'll leave you alone, okay? You'll leave me alone. No more trying to buy me drinks or flirt with me or anything. I swear to God. Okay, fine. Great, okay. So, you're always prepared, and you seem like an independent woman, and am I right so far? Yes. Are you a Pisces? Love to guess. Maybe, or maybe you and I are soulmates. You have to guess my birthday, not my son. I'm getting there, I'm getting there. Let me think. March 13th. I knew it. <laughs> Is this you and your girlfriend on your background? Yeah. She's very pretty. Isn't she? And she's smart and funny and kind and caring. She, she smells really good all the time. She's a great cook. She, she even laughs at my jokes. Your jokes? Yeah, like, okay, so a mushroom walks into a bar, right? The bartender says, sorry, man, no mushrooms allowed. And the mushroom says, why not? I'm a fun guy. <laughs> This again? Lynn, I thought we agreed we dropped the whole fake boyfriend thing. It's not a game. I'm actually here with my boyfriend. You're here with your boyfriend? Yes. Well, where is he? He's in the bathroom. In the bathroom? Is his name Max by any chance? Yeah, I have to know that. Oh, thanks, Taylor. Just put on my tab. You're a mojito, miss? No, wait, answer me. How'd you know his name was Max? I, uh, I heard a girl in the bathroom moan it. <laughs> what? <laughs> Yep. You heard a girl in the bathroom moaning Max's name. I'm sorry you have to hear about it like this. But That's impossible. <laughs> I'm telling you she was moaning his name loud and clear. I could see on the stall that he was wearing brown shoes. Sound like him? Yeah. Sorry I have to break it to you like this, but I heard what I heard. I have to go see this for myself. Wait, wait, what? I can't just sit here not knowing whether or not Max is cheating on me back. No, it's really him. No, 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 wait. <laughs> what? You can't go in there. And why not? Because you don't want to see something like that. It devastate you. Imagine if you saw something like that. It doesn't matter. I need to know. Really then hard. let me check for you. Just... It's okay. I can check for myself. Thank you. It'll crush you. I'll live. This is something I have to confirm with my own eyes. <laughs> I'm so sorry about that, Butterfingers. I'm completely <laughs> sorry about that. I'm really sorry about your dress. It's okay, I tried. I, I, sorry, I didn't wash it for you. Why? It's fine. Or buy a new one. It's fine. No, I think I might have a dress at my place if you want to come up. I'm fine. Now, if you'll please excuse me, there's something I need to check on in the bathroom. <laughs> you see that? <laughs> Do you think it's coincidence that girl coming out of the bathroom looking like she just got pounded? <laughs> now you believe me? No, I, I, I don't believe you. I, I can't believe you. Look, honey, don't let that guy get you down. Forget about him. Listen, he's a dog. But I mean, I have... What the fuck are you doing? I didn't ask you the same thing, Max. What were you doing in the bathroom? What? What were you doing in the bathroom, Max? I was using it. He was using you. Who the hell is this guy? Oh, you don't know him? Of course not. Well, he knew your name. He said I overheard a girl in the bathroom moaning it. What? Don't play dumb, man. She knows. Shut up. Baby, I have no idea what he's talking about. Of course that's what he's going to say. Then Bro, go. shut up. Tell me the truth, Max. Don't try to deny it, man. Bro, shut the fuck up. Lynn. Baby, honest, nothing happened in there. Look, look at his face, he's clearly guilty. Then you know me, you know I would never do something like this. What about that girl that came out of the bathroom? Yeah, how are you telling that? What about her? You think her and I had sex? Of course, I don't know what she thinks, you dirty cheating dog. Max, don't! <laughs> Baby, 
Why are you even listening to because this guy? Because he's telling you the truth. He isn't. Look at me, Lynn. I swear to you, on whatever you want me to swear on, that nothing happened in there. Okay, Are you Thank kidding God. me? You think she would take your word over mine without any evidence? Get the hell out of here, man. Hey, Max. That was fun earlier. <laughs> No, 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 wait, wait, baby, I have no idea what she was talking I about. I don't believe that you've been fucking her in there. Ordinarily, I wouldn't even cross my mind, but it seems pretty clear to me what's been going on here. No, no, wait, baby, I didn't have sex with her I saw her leave the bathroom, Max. What was that all about? I don't know. She, she came into there while I was there, said the girl's bathroom was dirty. We talked for a bit. I lent her my phone. That's it. What about that was fun, Max? Why'd she say she had fun? I, I, I don't know. I, I cracked a joke in there. Maybe that's what she meant. Why did you come to your phone? <laughs> She didn't have a way of getting home, and she said hers was dead. Shut up, baby. I can't believe you. Wait, baby, nothing happened in there, I swear. Hey, I need to borrow your phone now. I don't have a way of getting home, and I just really need to find a ride. You can write me home. Look, I'm not <laughs> gonna move, okay? Can I please just borrow your phone? Okay. What was your phone doing in your safe? Uh, I, I just like to keep it there sometimes. Hey, you got a text? Uh, don't look at that. Wait. That's a girl that was just with Max. Her name's Angie. You know her? Yeah, no. I mean, not really. What did she text you about? Is that Max? My my birthday? My, my mom? I have to learn to take people's things without asking first. You know. What are you doing here? I'm just trying to help my friend Christian find love. Well, that's the way I already found it, thanks. You found it? Don't make me laugh. Am I mistaken, or were you just making out Christian? <coughs> Do not come, honey. Do you think your girlfriend kissing some other guy is love? Well, I no. He kissed me. I would never kiss a guy like that. Why not? Because you're fucking gross. That's why. I <laughs> think that's your denial. About what? About this whole relationship with dead. I mean, I know you're trying to salvage it, obviously, but I can tell you right now, it's pointless. You might as well try to get another man now and again, and Christian might try and tell you otherwise. But you don't have many men lining up to date you. That's the thing, Angie. I don't need many men lining up to date me. I know who I am and what I'm worth independently. How many guys I'm currently sleeping with? I'm with Max because I want to be with Max, not because I need his love and affection to validate my existence. The you have some boyfriend you should be cheating on? Don't you have some glory hole you should be attending to? <laughs> Get out of my face. And you! <laughs> Baby, you are disgusting. They're using us. I, I told you. I can't believe you almost trusted that guy over me. You know, the, uh, the way you slapped that douchebag was <laughs> quite sexy. Well, that's how us powerful girls handle business. Oh, well, I'd like to see you handle my business like that. Oh, get it? Handle my business? Butter my baguette? Oh. <laughs> 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 I only handle large. Oh, well, mademoiselle, you're in luck. This baguette is a foot long. <laughs> oh, 